hope you're well and welcome to today's strength program where we're going to kick things off straight away with part one. We're looking for a 15 minute countdown timer. You've got four exercises complete, as many rounds as you can get in that 15 minutes. All right, so let's kick it off. So you're going to take a weight. Exercise number one, we're going to start with 10 dumbbell cleans per side. So a hinge over, bringing that dumbbell to my shoulder for 10 reps per arm. From there, come down to the floor, and we're going to take 10 dumbbell pullovers. So grab your dumbbell, hands either side, lie on your back, start with the dumbbell at the top, you're then going to reach over, maintain the slight elbow bend to the floor, and then back over to the top. Reach over, and then pull back over to the top. 10 reps total. Exercise number three, we're going to go with a lateral lunge and overhead press combo. So if I take my weight and I place it on my right hand, I'm going to lunge out on my left leg, drive back, press with my right arm. Left leg lunge, right arm presses. 10 on your left leg, then 10 on your right leg. Then your last exercise, either a single or a double uh, bent over reverse fly. So in this case, I'm gonna do a single. So I'm gonna go 10 reps per arm. Hinge over with a nice straight back. Squeezing the shoulder blade together. As I raise the dumbbell up, 10 reps per side. So 15 minutes, hit those four exercises. As many quality rounds as you can get. Right, good work so far. So you've now hit part one. We're now moving on to part two where we're going to take roughly a 10 minute countdown timer um, or roughly three to four rounds. And we've got three exercises to work through, just taking your time. So exercise number one, uh, we're actually using a TheraBand today, so some form of resistance band uh, is ideal. We're going to get 10 per side on a half kneeling uh, band of paddle press. So if my right knee is in front, I bring the band towards my belly button and then from there I press out 10 times in front of me on that side and then I'll rotate to the other side. Making sure as you press, you don't rotate your torso at all. So if it feels too easy, stand further away, set yourself up further away so there's more resistance uh, in the band. Exercise number two, we're gonna come to a cross body, single leg RDL for 10 reps per side. So find yourself in a split stance. In this case, I've got my left foot forward, I'm going to raise my right toes and bring my right fingers across my left knee, back to my split stance. Hinge over, back up. We're looking for 10 reps per side. Obviously body weight is slightly easier, you're going to make it harder, pull the weight in that front hand and maintain your balance for 10 reps per side. Exercise number three, we're going to come down to the shoulders. I'm going to come into a YTW raise, so we've got 10 reps on each letter. So lie face down for the Y, head down, thumbs up. Going to take 10 Ys. Then come to your T raise, 10 Ts, and then bend at the elbow, 10 Ws. Again, if you do want to make that one a little bit harder, use a light weight, hold a, um, a can of uh, beans or something. Otherwise, do it body weight and just make sure you're getting good squeezes and uh, good range through the shoulders. All right, so part three, welcome to the conditioning section, your final part for today's workout. So you've gone through your strength work, you've gone through your accessories work. Now let's finish with getting that heart rate nicely elevated for the last part of the workout. So what we're looking for is anywhere between six and 10 rounds of the following. You're gonna take a weight. In this case, I've got a six kilogram wall ball. You're gonna start with 12 thrusters. Remember, that's a full squat. Keep the knees out, full press above my head 12 times. And make sure you've got a good weight that really gets the heart rate up there. As soon as you've done your 12 thrusters, I want you to go straight into 30 seconds uh, of tough, uh, cardio type exercise. So jump on a machine, run around the garden, get high knees, get burpees, get skipping. Choose an exercise that you know is going to get your heart rate up and work you 
Uh, tough, it's gonna, be, it's gonna be hard. And then from there, give yourself a 30 second break. So allow the heart rate to come back down, allow yourself a bit of recovery, and then repeat that for six to 10 rounds. So again, just to summarize that, you're looking for 12 thrusters with a strong weight, straight into 30 seconds worth of tough exercise, straight into 30 seconds worth of rest, six to 10 rounds. Enjoy.